Especially when she reckless And babe, you're my bestest friend Yeah, she my bestie My love for you is endless Nobody else can end it Hello, my darlings You okay? It's me again Happy Friday <laughs> Um, yeah, I've been to Primark again and picked up a few more bits. Um, the town where my dad's in hospital is right by the, the, the actual town is right by the hospital and there's like a big uh, shopping square there and there's a, I did pop in there the other day, the one in West Bromwich, but I didn't have a proper look round so I went in and had a proper look round because I wanted to get me a new strapless bra and some new knickers and stuff. So I've got... A little Primark haul, just this one bag, but uh, I picked up a few nice bits again, so I thought I'd just pop on and share them with you, um, and just give you a little update on Dad, and I also just want to say thank you all for all your messages, all your comments, wishing my dad well, yeah, I really do appreciate it, I am going to sit when I've edited this video and um, have a look through all the comments, I've seen them coming through but I haven't read them all yet, and yeah, I'll give you all um, a love art and respond to as many as I possibly can. Uh, I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, he's not too good today. He's not out the woods yet, guys. Um, it's just one of them. We've got to take it uh, a day at a time. So uh, his blood pressure is low today. He's not drinking enough basically he's got bottles and bottles of water there we've took uh, bottles of squash and we're diluting the water for him but he's so tired and he's sleeping so much that he's not drinking enough uh he's not eating properly he says he's he feels sick um yeah he still can't breathe without the um oxygen so yeah he's not the best today and he was really really tired because he'd had a bit of a rough night with his breathing so uh yeah me and my sister was there and he was like there's no point you pair sitting here with me he says because i want to go to sleep so we had about three well my sister was there before me so uh, i ended up having about three quarters of an hour with him and yeah, opening his mail with him and stuff and having an attar and yeah, he told me to go basically because he wanted to go to sleep. But my other sister's there now. Well, she was about half an hour ago. I'm waiting for a message off her and then was taking him down for a CT scan. So yeah, that is the latest on my dad. He hasn't had the best day. He's very tired. He's very weak, but he's still fighting. So, yeah, I just thought I'd update you all and, like I say, say thank you for all your well wishes and your prayers and your hugs and all the love that you're sending. I really, really do appreciate it. So, with all that being said, let's get into um, this little haul. As I say, it's only a little one. It's only going to be a quick video today, my darlings. But when I do get home, because at the moment the, the plan is... I've got the wedding tomorrow, but I've told my sisters, if you need me, I'm about 15, 20 minutes away from the hospital, I can be there in a flash. So you just found me and they keep saying, it's okay, go and enjoy the wedding and if we need you, we'll find you. So that's what's going to happen there. Um, and then Sunday, I will obviously go up the hospital and see my dad. And then on Monday, I plan to go home to Wales for a couple of days because I need to take my suitcase and replenish my clothes and stuff like that, you know. Um, and then see what's happening from there because there's got to be a plan put in action for Dad to come home. I've already spoke to you about this, haven't I? Uh, so, yeah, I should probably go home for a couple of days and then I will possibly have to come back up. So, yeah, that's the plan. Right, let's get into this little haul. I'm just going to dig in. So the first thing that I picked up were these leggings, these flared leggings. They're so nice, the workout pants. They've got the little logo on the back there and they're really nice quality and they are flared. Chocolate brown, they are gorgeous. Just one sec, guys. I've got to take my shoes off. My feet are killing me. I've had my new trainers on today. Oh, oh but I've been on my feet since... About nine o'clock this morning, my feet are killing now. 
So, yeah, I've worn my new trainers today and them lovely. I love them. I showed you them ones yesterday, didn't I, in uh, yesterday's haul. So, yeah, I've got the chocolate brown leggings. These are gorgeous. Thought for every day, you know, with some trainers and a nice little little top. They look really nice. And these were £12. And I picked them up in a size large. It doesn't actually say what a large is on these. But, I'm, oh, it does, 14 to 16. So, yeah, I picked them up in a large. They're nice, aren't they? I love that colour. They had them in black, navy, grey. But I haven't got any chocolate brown leggings or anything. So, yeah, that's why I picked those up. I love those. I also got this. I thought this would look nice with those leggings. It's this taupe coloured body. How nice is that with the spaghetti straps? Great layering piece for autumn. This was from the Rita Ora range and this was seven pounds. And it's like, it's not a, like a full bum, it's a thong. So I thought that'd be quite comfy. I hope it, yeah, it will fit me. Well, it'll be too big, I don't think. And these are stretchy, so it's gonna be really comfortable. The material's lovely. It's double lined by the bust area as well. Absolutely gorgeous, and I love the colour. Uh, and this was, did I say, seven pound? Losing my mind, and I got it in a size large. <laughs> so yeah, I thought that would look really nice with these, these chocolate brown, chocolate brown leggings, and these trainers, because that's very really similar colour on the trainers to what's on the the body. So yeah, thought that'd be a nice little outfit. Next up is just a basic white top uh, like this one. I love them. Uh, yeah, just a plain white basic long sleeve top like I've got on now. And it's a regular fit one. It's from the Primark Cares range. 95% cotton, this one is. Uh, from the Primark Sustainable Cotton Programme. I picked it up in a size medium because I wanted it to be a little bit more fitted and this was £4. And the medium at Primark is a... Oh, I don't know. It don't say on there. I think it's... Is it a 12 to 14? It doesn't say. Anyway, it's just a medium. Just like the one I'm wearing. I really do like these basics. Again, great for layering in the autumn and winter. They've got those in so many colours. But I'm not the best off for white tops. Although I do, I can't keep them white for very long. I don't know. I've even got a mark on this one on the arm and I don't know where it's come from. I don't know whether you can see it. There's a mark there. I don't know where it's come from. I can't keep them clean. <laughs> and then I got these. Now I could not see um a price or anything on these but i thought these was really nice strapless bras this was the only large on the on the stand oh god it's not even a, a large it's that one's a small them two different sizes the whites are small and the blacks are large bloody hell but they're the strapless bras, but lacy ones. Really nice quality they are. And as I say, there was no tag or anything on it. Can't believe that. That's not going to fit round me. Little white lacy bra. That That is definitely, definitely not going to fit me. No. <laughs> so, yeah, might have to pop that on Vinted or something. Uh, so it's a size small, which is a... 10 to 12 well you would have thought you know so somebody else has probably got one like that as well but their their black one will be a size small and the white will be a size large but anyway i paid a fiver for the two i don't know how much they should have been because he had to key the the barcode in off here and it was a fiver for the two so they must be selling them off so yeah that one's going to have to be gone put on my vintage brand new oh well Next, I got these seam free knickers, seam free minis, they are, and I got these in a size 12, just three pairs of 
big knickers basically comfort isn't it absolute comfort and again these are from recycled nylon and these were six pound six pound for the three pairs they had all different styles in these as well and different fabrics but i really liked this fabric it feels quite thick like it's gonna you know have a little bit of control in it so yeah i picked up those and then I also picked up this one. This is a high rise thong. This is to wear under my outfit tomorrow at the wedding. Um, and it's just got a little bit of tummy control there just to smooth me out a little bit. Uh, yeah, so I picked up the thong one and that was six pound and I got that in a medium as well. And a medium is a 12 to 14, I thought it was. So yeah, I got that. Oh, I've had my nails done as well. I went to the salon and got my nails painted. They're lovely, aren't they? I love that color. They're growing now. That one broke, the little one. But yeah, they're, they're really growing now. So yeah, I went and had my nails painted. Um, yeah, six pound for the uh, control thong. I also picked up this little jumper. It's absolutely gorgeous. Now the jumpers in Primark at the minute, I do not know what's going on with the material and they're ugly. There's stripes everywhere, you know, and I, I don't like stripes that go across this way. They look great on other people, but I think if you like carry a little bit of weight, wearing stripes that go across this way is just a huge no, because they just make you look even wider. I just, it's each to their own, but they're just not for me. And the material of some of them, itchy. I had to keep doing this to see whether there was like gonna itch me. They had got some nice ones, you know, with the collars on and stuff like that, just plain ones. But the material was vile, I just couldn't. So, but I did pick up this one. This one is really, really soft. And it's this gorgeous grey, V-neck, V-back. And it's quite, you know, slouchy, um, back wing sleeve kind of thing, like, yeah. Uh, not too long, but not too short either. Absolutely love that. I thought that would look really nice with a pair of jeans or a pair of leggings yeah really like that and this was 11 pound and i got it in a size large and some of the prices of the knitwear as well that for primark was pro quite pricey and the material was just horrible it proper itchy you know what i mean don't you excuse me i don't know whether they've got some kind of wool content in them but you know itchy wool I couldn't, and especially up around my neck, oh no. So, I, that's the only jumper that I got, even though I did see some nice ones, but I couldn't count with the material. I also picked up another bodysuit, but this time I got the black in the thong, in the size large, and again, this was seven pound. Can't go wrong, can ya, with um, a bodysuit. Really like that one, and I love the stretchy spaghetti straps. Yeah, this one's lovely material. Again, it's double lined inside around the bust area. So that's good, isn't it? Um, it's more or less the same as the Rita Aurora one, but this is black and it hasn't got the Rita Aurora name on it. In fact, this one's a bit thicker than the Rita Aurora one. And then I've got another bodysuit. <laughs> but this one is a ribbed one. This one is such lovely quality. Look at that. That's gonna like smooth you right out, that is. It's quite body con. And this one's got the thicker like vest style straps. And this one was seven pound again. And it, this one again is made from recycled nylon. And it, this was seven pounds as well. Yeah, so, but this one's a full bum on this one. It's not a thong, but that one was really, really nice. Love that. And the last item was a pair of trousers. I saw these the other day and I really liked them and I thought, you know what? When I walked back in today and I saw them, I thought, I'm gonna get them because I'm really into trousers at the moment, wide leg trousers, that especially the tailored ones, they're so flattering. They really, really are and I feel great in them. So I got these and these are from the Rita Aurora range as well. Very similar to the ones that I got yesterday with the waistcoat, aren't they? I picked them up in a size 14 and they were 18 pound. Again, tailored with the darts down the front, side pockets 
and they, these are super wide leg. Now, I Carrie laughed at me yesterday when we was in Primark because I said to her, I says, I wonder if they'll fit me. So I took them off the hanger and I put them round my neck like this. And they fit round my neck. So apparently, this is the thing, if they fit round your neck, and I've got a little bit of room there as well. If they fit round your neck, they're going to fit you on your body. If it's true, I do not know because I've yet to try anything on. <laughs> Oh, my light's just gone out. Sorry about that. The light's just changed. My little um, ring light thing that I got attached to my phone. So the light's just... I'm nearly done now anyway. Sorry about that. So, yeah, um, I think they will fit me. Yeah, they definitely will fit me. Because they're quite high waisties. Yeah, they look like they will. But, yeah, a little tip for you there. I don't know if it's true. If any of you ever have ever tried it and it works, let me know. Uh, put your, your waistband around your neck. <laughs> So that is everything that I picked up in Primark today. I'm not going again. I normally call into Telford when I'm on my way home, but I'm not going to this week. <laughs> I'm just going to go straight home because I've got everything I need now um, for my autumn and winter wardrobe. But I don't think there'll be... I mean, I, I think I've got... Um, yeah, I've got... Uh, Lara have uh, um, sent me some jeans and stuff that... Um, I'll have to do that when I get out. I think I think it's been delivered. Les says I have had some parcels. So, they'll, you know, as regards clothing, I've got to sort my wardrobe out as well. Um, as regards any more Primark hauls, it'll be nearer Christmas now. Um, and it'll probably be like Christmas presents, jammers and stuff like that. But, yeah, that's everything that I picked up in Primark today. Uh, how long have we been going? Oh, not too long. This video is only going to be about 15, 20 minutes long. So that's all right, isn't it? But I just wanted to check in. I do hope you've enjoyed the video today. Um, if you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also subscribe down below if you haven't already. It would be great to have you join my YouTube family. If you are new here, a massive welcome to you. I do hope that you'll stick around and, yeah, enjoy your time here with us. We're a great bunch, aren't we? <laughs> and to all you who keep coming back and supporting me and commenting and watching my videos, I really, really do appreciate it. I know that I've slacked on my comments comments at the moment guys and I'm so sorry that I haven't been getting back to you all but I know you understand the situation I know you understand but I am going to try and answer a few of your comments this evening but if I don't answer yet I will always give you a love heart please don't think I'm being rude or you know just can't be bothered that is not the case at all I see all the comments and yeah it means the world to me and i will do my utmost to try and get back to as many comment comments as i possibly can um so thank you um yeah what i'm gonna do now i am gonna have me something to eat i don't know what to have let me show you what i've got in the fridge <laughs> i went to um tesco's the other day so i've got this uh chicken spicy chicken pizza so i could have that with salad and some um, Korean style chicken bites that I had from Tesco's. This is from Yao Sushi. These was reduced to £3.50. So I could add them with salad and pizza. Last night I had um, a chicken katsu chicken curry that was reduced from yao sushi it was lovely that's what i had for my tea last night so the options tonight are the korean bite chicken bite salad and pizza or the korean chicken bites salad and one of these three carbonara lasagna or chicken and bacon pasta. As you can see, I love pasta. But I think what I am going to do, I'm going to save that pizza. I might have that um, Sunday um, and share it with Josh or something like that because that's a big pizza to eat on my own as well as salad and chicken. I mean, I could. 
But as you know, I'm trying to eat a little bit cleaner. I know pizza's not clean, but it's only a thin and crispy one. And I've had nothing today yet. I've had no calories. I haven't even took my bloody greens today. I forgot this morning. So I've got to do that. I've got to order me some more of them. I'm nearly out. Um, so I think what I might have is the chicken bites, some of this salad, because um, the rest I can have tomorrow. With some. Oh, no, I'll be at the wedding tomorrow, so I won't need it tomorrow. I can use the rest on Sunday. And I think I'm going to have this chicken and bacon pasta. Yeah, with the chicken bites and salads. That's what I'm going to have, I think. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I'm going to have for my tea. I've left it out because I'm going to cook it when I'm um, when I, well, warm it up when I've just said goodbye to you all now. So, my darlings, I am going to go now. I've got to dye my hair. That's, how, that's what I was saying. I'm going to have something to eat. Now I've showed you what I'm having. I'm going to dye my hair, have a bath, shave my legs and everything, get all my stuff ready. And Well, it's ready, to be honest. I've got it all hung up already. Uh, I've just got to put my jewellery out and, you know, my belt and take them out the bag and stuff like that and get all that ready um, for in the morning. Well, three o'clock the wedding is, so I've got plenty of time in the morning when I wake up to, you know, straighten my hair and get ready because what I'll do tonight I'll just uh, dye my hair and let it just dry naturally on its own and then tomorrow I'll style it with the straighteners and that so yeah rather than doing it twice so yeah that's my plan for my Friday evening I'm so rock and roll <laughs> I hope you guys have a great Friday evening I really really do um, and I will see you all when will I see ya it on Monday, Monday, the video that I was telling you about that the timeline's going to be all off. I've had confirmation from the company to say that I can post it on the 23rd, which is Monday. Uh, so you will be seeing that little vlog on Monday. But don't fret, OK? Um, it's The timeline's all backwards because I, I filmed it last week, as I explained in yesterday's video. And if you haven't seen yesterday's Primark haul, I'll leave that link down below as well for anybody who hasn't seen that. Uh, yeah, my darlings, I'm going to stop rambling on because I could stand here all night and talk to you. I really, really could. But I'm not going <laughs> to. I'm going to make me a coffee. Actually, I'm going to make me one of these. They are so nice. I had one yesterday in my pumpkin mug, which is soaking in the sink there. So I'm going to make me one of these. I'm going to edit the video while my dinner's warming up in the oven and do all that. And, yeah, just pamper myself for the rest of the evening, put a bit of YouTube on in the background and stuff like that. OK, I really do hope that you have had... A great day, a great week. I hope you enjoy the rest of your evening, whatever you're doing on this fine Friday night. Although the forecast thunderstorms, apparently quite bad storms throughout the night here in the Midlands. They said there could be a loss of power. I hope not because I will absolutely shit my pants because I'm on my bloody Owen. <laughs> so, yeah, pray for me. And I hope you're all safe because, yeah, they forecast these terrible storms i've just heard it on the radio so no one panicking about that but anyway i'll have to charge my light up wow no just make sure my lights charged so i'll have a bit of light if the power goes out oh bloody hell <laughs> so yeah <sighs> honestly I, I do my own heading i really do my own heading I don't know whether I've already said it, but if you did like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe down below. If you haven't already, it'd be great to have you join my YouTube family. <laughs> okay, I love you guys loads. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today and just being my way of, you're my outlet. You really are. You are my outlet and you are all amazing. You are all amazing. And I love you all so much. And I'll see you all in the next one. Tarot beads.